YC-141B is a stretch version of the C-141 Lockheed Starlifter. It's 23 feet longer than the standard model. Aerial delivery testing of the YC-141B was conducted at AFSC's Air Force Flight Test Center, Edwards Air Force Base. The YC-141B uses the same dual rail cargo deck as the basic aircraft, but it carries three additional 463L cargo pallets. Flight Test Center people experienced in numerous aerial delivery tests conducted this series. Standard C-141 checklists and procedures were evaluated as satisfactory for the stretch version. Among the tests conducted were extraction parachute tow tests. These included deployment, inflation, towing, and cutaway. This is a cluster of two 28-foot diameter ring slot parachutes. Before live personnel drops, retrieval tests were made of 60 static lines with weighted bags. Tests on articulated dummies reduce the risk of injury. Personnel airdrop tests included two sticks of eight jumpers dropped simultaneously. Army and Air Force jumpers with experience in the basic C-141 were used in these tests. Jumpers commented that there were only slight differences in jumping from the stretch 141 and the basic aircraft. Single platform loads weighing from 2,060 to 34,000 pounds were test dropped. Loads less than 15,000 pounds produced negligible pitch attitude change. More than 15,000 pounds produced definite aircraft pitch up, then pitch down. Aircraft pitch changes were about the same as for the basic C-141. On sequential platform tests, each load extracted the parachute of the next load. Three loads with a total weight of nearly 70,000 pounds were dropped. It took six hours to rig the sequential drop in the aircraft, and only 11 seconds for the air drop. The aerial delivery tests were successful. All objectives were met, and no problems in platform or personnel airdrops were encountered. The YC-141B, or Stretch Starlifter, brings increased cargo capacity and more effective use of Air Force resources.